Bryce here again for the Glue Bomb Show. Now, I don't know about you, but I've been having a hard time finding spray paint lately. And I've been looking through, I was at my local Michaels today, and I found literally like three colors, one of which was flat red to paint my next kit. And needless to say, I really don't want to do a kit in flat red, so I had to look for something else. And I, I did find something a little time back, and I've decided I'm going to use these for a while now. Uh, this is the Krylon Shortcut Spray Paint. Now, I have to be honest with you. I was a little hesitant with this because it does not say it's useful for plastic on the can. However, I decided to take it home and test it. And I used this on my 69 AMX, Big Bad Blue AMX that I just built that I'll be reviewing shortly. And it worked really well. Now... I am always hesitant to recommend products. And part of the reason I'm hesitant to recommend it is because I know you guys spend some high dollars on some of your kits. However, I tried it and it worked. What I would recommend is before you spray this on one of your expensive kits, go ahead and spray it on a plastic spoon. Make sure that it works in a way that's satisfactory for you. But I have to say it did pretty well for me. So uh, Krylon Shortcuts, again, try it out. If you're looking for paint, uh, they have a, a pretty good variety of colors. You're not going to get a lot of metallics and stuff like that. But for your, just your straight up shiny colors, I think it did pretty well. And you'll see that in the next episode. All right. That's it for today, guys. Remember, please, please, please don't take any of my recommendations without testing it on something inexpensive first, okay? Because remember, model building is supposed to be fun. So have fun. Take care.